Hey guys, what's going on? Mayhem here. Today we're going to be continuing my Make Your Own RuneScape private server series. And today we're going to be making ourselves admin, mod, whatever you guys want to be, owner. And that way we can use commands in the game and we can save things. So the first thing we're going to do is go to our RSPS folder and open up Eclipse. Make sure that you've watched the first video. If you haven't, a link will be in the dis or I don't know. I'll probably have like a playlist link in the description or something. But um, we're gonna go ahead and open up Eclipse. I want to show you guys something else that uh someone <coughs> pointed out to me in the comments. If you're having problems, always read the comments. But what we're gonna do, if some of you are having an error running your client, what you want to do is right click run. If you get like the unspecified path. And you want to change program files right here. You want to hit space parentheses x86. And that's because that your Java is located somewhere else besides the program files. Don't save that if yours is working fine. But if you were having problems in the other video and it said cannot find specified path or something like that, then you should change that. Otherwise, don't do that. Don't want to confuse you guys. Um, but if everything's working just fine for you, we're going to go here into Eclipse. And what we're going to do is look for player.java, which should be in SRC, com, RS, game, and then player. And then we'll scroll, scroll down here to player.java. We'll double click and open that. Let me go ahead and full screen this for you guys. Now what we want to do is hit control F to search or find. And we're going to type in logger.log and hit find. And right here, we're going to um, hit space, and we're going to copy the code I have in the description. Hold on, let me copy it here. It's on my other monitor. And where it says username on this code, what you're going to want to do is type the player's username. So my username on the server that I've made is Logan. And what the rights are... Um, Rights equals seven means owner. Rights equal two is admin. Right equals one is mod. Now, if you want to add other players to your server that um, you want to have th these rights as well, what you can do is hit enter and then hit control V to paste it in again, and then you would just put their username here. All right, and I'm going to erase that because I currently don't. And we'll bring it up to there. Okay. And now we can exit out up here on the player.java and we're going to go ahead and click server and hit run. Should get loaded up just fine here. All right, and I'm going to pause the video because I'm trying to avoid getting copyrighted the best that I can. I'm going to pause the video, go into the game and just make sure 100% that that worked. Okay, so that did indeed work. I'm now owner of the server. Now, what you guys want to do, if you want to save your content, like if you've done anything on the server, like you've got some items, got some drops or something, and you want to save that, every time you're ready to quit playing, you have to hit the tilde and type in shut down. And this, like this blue box will appear, and you type shut down in, and then you hit enter, and then it'll say system update right above your chat box. And I, I would show you guys an example, but like I said, I'm trying not to get copyrighted by Jagex here. These videos are strictly for educational purposes only, but... You know, sometimes they'll get you with copyright anyway. I'm just trying to help everyone out here. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this short little video. Hopefully you're having fun on your server. I'm going to try and make a few more of these videos. I know I haven't been putting them out at all. I only have that one. But again, hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you're having fun. And uh, next video, I'll probably show you guys how to remove that tutorial. Because it's kind of annoying. And uh, thanks again for watching. I'll talk to you guys next time. Peace out.